We're going to estimate solutions by rounding each number to one significant figure. Moving on to looking at the squares and square roots of numbers. So for question A, we're going to round 3486 to one significant figure. So this becomes 3000. I'm going to multiply that by 67 to one significant figure, which becomes 70. So this estimate, 3 times 7 is 21. And with four zeros, 21, 210,000. For question B, this should be approximately 58.74 to one significant figure, which is going to be 60, divided by 2.98, which will make 3. 60 divided by 3 would be 20. For question C, 469 would become 500 because if a 6 would round up a 4 to a 5. And 3.5 would become 4 divided by 19.54. The 9 would round up a 1 to a 2, so that becomes 20. Let's make it 2000. Divide that by 20. And you can simply find this fraction by dividing both by 20. And this makes 100 divided by 1, which is 100. For question D, 48.58 becomes 50 over 5 times 16.7, which is rounded to 20, over 4.91, which is rounded to 5. 50 divided by 5 is 10, times 20 divided by 5, which is 4. So that comes out as 40. And for question A, 9.78, we round to 10. And 10 squared is 100. Question F is slightly more difficult. Because we're not going to round it to a significant figure. But we're going to round it to its nearest. Which is 49. And the square root of 49 is 7. Thank you for watching.